Now that those temperatures are starting to fall rapidly, more people will be turning their heat on in the home. But with some heating systems comes the danger of carbon monoxide. Now your side's Gabby Sartori spoke with an expert on the risks and strategies of limiting exposure to it. Carbon monoxide, known as CO, is an odorless and colorless gas that's extremely dangerous and can even be fatal when breathed in. As the days get colder, it's important to know the risks of CO poisoning and where it comes from. Carbon monoxide is a toxic uh, gas that's produced from uh, burning a lot of a lot of heat sources that might be burning burning trash burning diesel fuel burning gasoline um, can come from a gas stove things that we think about as emergency physicians quite a bit are space heaters that might not be safe carbon monoxide is silent and invisible it can also be built up in enclosed or partially enclosed spaces especially when starting cars in closed garages getting fresh air and being sure that you're not in an enclosed space is the important thing do not warm that car up in that garage um, and get in there and sit for five or six minutes and check your email and you know uh, check in with social media while you think it's warming up although temps are dropping people need to know the risks of the silent killer especially when finding ways to stay warm some of the things we see people do are really natural responses to the cold, right? They're trying to get in and find heat. They're huddling around a heat source. Um, they're thinking, hey, this is a creative use. So let me let me use that oven. Let me use my stove. Um, let me get in my car and turn it on. Patterson adds that it's important to have a carbon monoxide detector to be sure it's working. She also says if you're looking for any source of heat, always make sure you have ventilation. In Greenville, Gabby Sartori, 9 on your side.